Are your suet feeders empty? And you're worried about your birds starving. But you can't go anywhere because there was an ice storm? And it's just not safe to go to the store right now? Yes, that's oddly specific. Well, don't worry, because the birds will probably be fine with all the natural food sources they've used for millions of years. But if you'd like to give them a little leg up and make you feel better at the same time, we can make our own suet and your own suet feeder. First, let's make some suet. You'll need vegetable shortening, cornmeal, peanut butter, heck, let's throw some sunflower seeds and mealworms in there too. You can even mix in some bird seed. We're using an adaptation of the Marvel Meal from Penn State Extension. Begin by melting your shortening and then let it cool off a bit before adding it to the other ingredients. Next, we'll mix all of our yummy ingredients together. Mmm, this looks delicious. If I was a woodpecker. Now, let that cool and harden. Another note, watch out when placing suet out during warm weather, as the higher temperatures can make some recipes turn rancid. Next, let's transform a log into a suet feeder. I bet you've got lots of fallen limbs after that ice storm. Golly, I, I sure do. Now, we could smear the suet mix directly on the log, but we could fit even more by drilling some holes into the wood first. Use whatever large high-speed or paddle drill bit that you have on hand. It's time to figure out a way to hang this. We're going to use an eye bolt screw. Pre-drill your hole to make it easier, and then screw in the eye bolt. Use a screwdriver to give you more leverage. Now, let's slather that log in some homemade suet. Yum, yum, yummy, yum. Hey, Pooch, stay back. This is for the birds. Well, we're almost done. Now it's time to find a sturdy limb or a garden hook to hang your new suet log feeder. Now you can rest assured that you help give the birds some extra calories to get through this cold stretch of weather. Thank you, strange disembodied voice. You're welcome. And as always, keep on growing.